Hi guys, this is my review of the Omega ROM version 7.2 for the Galaxy Note 2 GT N7 100. This is the Android 4.1.2, that's the Jelly Bean. As we don't have the official 4.1.2 for the Galaxy Note 2, so these ROMs are based on the leaked firmwares. So hit link 1 for the installation method and link 2 will lead you to the ROM thread so you can download the ROM from there. So coming to the review, you get two new features that's been added with this ROM. The first one is the multi-window control, I'll come to it within a minute. And second one is the ink effect. This is the ink effect, that you can see it. But with the finger you don't get the ink effect, just with your S Pen only. And you can also customize your ink color. Just to show you, going on to lock screen, lock screen options. And here you can see ink effect and you can choose the color of the ink. Say it's pink, you get a preview over here. Blue, okay this looks good. And just to show you. Okay, they can see. That's good. You have this uh, transparent weather widget. You can see a different battery icon. And the notification bar with 15 toggles. But then again, you don't have the animation, you know, as soon as you slide the notification bar. With the Jelly Bean notification bar, it automatically slides to the first toggle. But with this ROM, you don't have it. You do get some pre-installed apps like the Jelly Bean camera, the Jelly Bean clock. And, and you get to choose additional apps in the ROM installer while flashing this ROM. So with the Jelly Bean clock, we have this new widget, the analog clock, the circle one. That's really good. Just a second. I hope you can see it, yep. Other than that, you get the widgets like the assistive lights, all the widgets are available that you get with the stock firmware. And you have this jelly bean camera as well, with this ROM. You can touch to focus, see I want to focus this area. Okay, it's been focused, now I want to focus this area. Okay, it's focused, so it's, it's working fine. And another thing I was talking about was the multi-window. So by default, in the multi-window tray, you get some limited apps, but this app lets you add additional apps on your multi-window tray. Just to show you, now I have these apps. Okay, I have these apps. I don't have any camera app on, on my multi-window. Now just to add it, what you need to do is open up multi-window control, hit add application, add, and select the camera app. All right, now I have the camera app. Now we'll just go back, hit kill, and go back, back. Now opening up the multi-window tray. Now just go to edit, and you can simply drag and drop it on the tray. Now you can simultaneously open up camera at one window, and say I want the video player on another window. Now you can simultaneously take shots, and you can also do your another task as well. There you have it. So it works fine. So these are the new things with this ROM. Other than that, everything is the same that you get with the stock Jelly Bean, that you get with the Galaxy Note by default. All the apps, everything works perfect, no issues with any of the functionality, no crashes, no lags or anything. And guys, you can uh, customize your toggles you know, by using this quick panel settings. You can change the widget order, the change of the you can change the toggles order and you can also remove toggles that you don't want on your notification bar so that's really good everything works just to show you you have all the S Pen functions working snipping any area okay you have it taking the screenshot it's working fine and even the S Note no issues with it it's working. There you have it. No crashes while opening up any app. For example, say Paper Artist. Okay, it's working. Even S Voice. Working fine. Google now works as well. So guys, everything is working. 
and even the battery life is really really decent you know it's slightly better than the stock jelly bean rom so definitely you know this rom is really good and you do get some changes and some new add-ons with this rom so that's all about my review guys thanks a lot for watching stay subscribed bye bye now and have a good day